Welcome to Success Factors Introduction to Mastery course. This is the basic course in Success Factors that you will need to take if you want to take training on other modules. If you have not taken the Mastery course and you want to take the training in other modules, you can. But when you want to take a certification exam, they would want to see if you have completed the Mastery course. So let's begin. This is the SAP Success Factors login screen. Enter your username and password here. Depending on your level of access, you would see different screens when you log in. Now this screen is the admin screen. It means you have access to carry out configuration and make changes in the system. End users would not have access to this page. This is the personal profile page. When you log in as an admin, you would also have your own page which stores all your personal information. Whatever changes you would make as an admin would reflect on this page. If you would like to navigate to a different module like compensation, performance, etc. You can do it from the menu button. Click the pull down arrow on the menu tab. You want to view your personal information or apply for a leave of absence. You can do so by clicking the cog wheel. When you click on the cog wheel, it shows you what's behind the tile. Click on the cog wheel here. This links here relate to the employee's personal information. You can view all the personal related information at one place. To go back, click the back button over here. We will now look at adding a new tile. A tile is like a block where you can store links that can be easily accessed by the employee. You can create your own new tile or you can select one provided by success factors. Let's add a new tile. To add a new tile, click here. We will add my goals as a tile to our home page. Then we will click here to add to the home page. My goal style is now added to your home page. If you don't like the current place where my tile is placed, you can always move it anywhere on this page. All you need to do is place your cursor on the blue bar and drag it to another location. Now if you want to go back to the admin page, here is how you can move to the admin center from your personal profile page. 